Hello and welcome to Everything to Guppy, the podcast where we talk about every single item, every single enemy, every single everything in The Binding of Isaac. I'm William Hughes, and I'm joined, as always, by a guy who uh, really went from hero to zero, technology version, Gary Butterfield. Gary, I didn't have one. Gary, I didn't have one. Are you... I am zero technology. Hello, Mega Man. I am blonde. Okay, that's not what zero sounds like at all. Zero sounds like a real standard like anime boy. Well, I don't do that voice because I don't like it. Hey, everybody, we're fighting the bad guys. Hey, Mega Man, you've got to fight. You've got to fight the good fight. For justice. Gary, that was really good. You said you didn't do that voice, and then you fucking did that exact voice. That was very good. I know. I can do the the generic anime hero Cam Clark uh, Leonardo voice. I don't like it, though. I don't like it about myself. I, um, Gary, I appreciate that, that often the things that we love, that, that we're best at, are not the things we cherish about ourselves. What's your least favorite thing about yourself, Will? Oh, um, I, I'm kind of a control freak. Like, I okay. have a, a, a hard time trusting others to uh, get stuff done, uh, which stems more from my anxiety than my opinion of others, but... Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Checks out. Fat, too. No, is that your least favorite, though? Does that compete? Uh, I mean, I guess, yes. Okay. Uh, how about you? Um, I'd have to say uh, my my uh, snake-sized dick. I was about to say dick too big. Dick too big. Yeah, no, it's, it's, it's actually pretty average. I love that the average went down. Did you guys see that? Or did you see that? The, <laughs> y'all, uh, y'all see that? Y'all see this? I guess I was talking to the, the listeners at that point. But the, uh, Fucking doing yeah. your Leno monologue? <laughs> the uh, uh the uh the people they really reveal that a lot of people have been lying about their dick size the average is actually smaller uh which makes me feel you know good yeah moving up in that old world yeah move up a little bit by the mean you know um yeah and of course people they had a self-reported dick size survey come on kinsey yeah i mean Idiot. you know and we all when we have the ruler down there we're definitely pushing it into the the fupa or whatever it's called totally. pretty hard to, to get yeah. that extra centimeter yeah and yeah, you measure from you know like you do it from the bottom so you can grab a little bit of ball sack in there like it there's a lot of hacks we all we all put a little bit of ball sack in that measurement don't we just a little bit a little bit because i mean it counts it goes in when you fuck yeah um, um and also of course you're pulling the penis as hard as you can like oh, stretching dude. it and, until yeah. you feel stuff break in there because you got to get those extra millimeters was well, a big reason why I got the piercing so I could stick a weight on it, like the Jim Rose Psycho Circus. Sure. And and stretch it out and hang a weight from it for measuring. Yeah. Mm-hmm. What is that? Uh, was that a uh, Duke Albert? You get, or you go for the full prince? Uh, I went for the King Albert. Ooh, he was never king. Yeah. He was the prince uh, consort. No, no, my dick is, though. Oh, congratulations. And, yeah. It's actually, you can, uh, you can zip line by it. It's a very strong connection. Like the connection between your tears and technology zero. Segway Lord. Segway don't feel Lord. Ashamed. Don't feel ashamed of that, baby. Um, <laughs> I, boy, I, I won't, buddy. It's it's a it's nice to do a good item this week that isn't just like this is annoying. Yeah. <laughs> uh, you know, I'm not I'm not filled with repulsion at this item. Extremely uh, rare Gary Butterfield mind state. I, it's true. Uh, this is great. The technology items tend to be great. Yeah, uh, uh, this got nerfed a bunch in Repentance, which is too bad. Yep. But uh, it's still good though; it's still purely additive. Yeah, um, this makes any of the tears on the screen that are nearby, so your tears or familiar tears or like tears you fire through uh, Tammy's head, mm-hmm. uh, get connected with electricity to each other. So yeah, so this and... is this gets more interesting. Obviously, like the more the the better your tear rate. If you have like soy milk, this gets very cool looking. mm Hmm. Uh, it also, you know, and this, uh, I had this recently on my like old Isaac, uh, pre-repentance thing where it did a hundred percent of Isaac's tear damage. Um, this, if you wave your, uh, you kind of move Isaac around. So you're mm-hmm. shooting these wide swaths of tears. Um, it does your tear damage per tick. Oh, wow. And it, you know, so enemy, it'll move through enemies, uh, and just do huge damage to them. So I think it, it probably earned the, the, the nerf. Earn um, that nerf. Earn that nerf. Um, Yeah. It's uh, it's extremely good. Uh, yeah, nothing else to say. Just good, purely additive. It's it's kind of steampunky in its vibe. The idea being like this is like an early uh, aspect of technology. So you have like instead of like weird laser eyes, you have laser monocles. Yes, you have two of them though. Yeah, yeah, 
and the uh, the which is two, rare two monocles. Ooh. Shout like, out to like Monocles a, Pizza, Midwest Pizza Chain. Very good pizza. Monocles? Monocles, yeah. It's uh, it's like an Indiana, like uh, Western Il- Indiana, Eastern Illinois pizza chain. Is the uh, little tiny cartoon chef on it? Does he have pepperonis for monocles? Uh, he like doesn't, Gary, monocle? on account of it being spelled different. Oh. Well, that, that fucking took the joy out of all this. That, I mean, Gary, I guess that's what I hate most about myself is that I did that to you. Yeah. Like, if it's spelled different, why did you even bring it up? Sound. Oh, sound. Homophone. Sound. Sound, brother. Um, uh, like the sound of a guy uh, on a devil bike pounding the loudest dance music in the world. Yes. Also happened to us. <laughs> Which uh, a, a, a truck and convoy, uh, devil bike man, <laughs> outside playing music that is too loud to talk over. So we're, we're just walking down the street, like we've just turned onto a fairly busy Portland street, and we're just having a chat, yeah. and when suddenly you start hearing the oons, 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 mm-hmm. oons. Like, oh, this is fun. And then it just gets louder and louder, <laughs> and <laughs> louder and louder. Yep. Uh, and then this convoy came by, uh, front of it, Santa Devil, uh-huh. like an old man dressed up as the devil on a devil bike, followed by a suicide girl. Uh-huh. Followed by, like, Linda from Accounting. A super normal lady, yeah. yeah who might have just, just gotten, lady. like, caught up in the backdraft. Yeah, <laughs> just got sucked in, got recruited to the never-ending dance of the Cosmic Fool. Um, yeah, and then it happened to us at the hot dog place as well when California Love came on. Oh, my God. And they turned it up twice. <laughs> yeah, they turned it up once. It was like, oh, this is very loud now. Yeah, uh, then turned it up again. And I, I would have respected it a lot if they would have just kept going with it. Yeah. <laughs> you know, but they eventually turned it down. The song is a bop. Uh, can't argue with that. Can't argue with the boppishness of that song. What uh, what if people like this show? I'm not trying to rush us, but I do have a thing. No, we're good. We said our we said our piece. We said our we said our piece. Uh, there should really be a technology transformation in Isaac. There should absolutely be a fucking tech. Oh my god, Gary! Isaac turns into yeah. a little laser bot. Yeah, a little robot. Because like when you get multiple technology items, that's great. That feels so good. Uh, the, I've gotten tech one and tech two on the same run a couple times and it's just a joy. You should turn into like a little El Vibrato guy from uh, West of Loathing. Yes. Yes. I love that uh, aesthetic. Shout out to Riff. Yeah. I love your Riff. Uh, patreon.com slash duck feed TV. Yeah. Provide some cash. Source. Yeah. Provide some cash to the, uh, to the old network. Yeah. The old this old network could use your cash. Oh, this old network's bone dry we're very <laughs> this old this old network he played what did, what is it he played i don't remember uh you can also uh leave us a <laughs> what a fucking did you just fucking hit a banana in mario kart but in your brain <laughs> jesus dude <laughs> this old man he played <laughs> What did he play? Don't go back. He played one, you motherfucker. He well, played knickknack on his thumb. Okay. Well, here's the thing is I thought one was going to be the rhyme. So I was looking for things he could play that rhymed with one. No. I was like, the old man doesn't play thumb. That's fucking disgusting. <laughs> I cannot for the fucking life of me believe you went back for that. <laughs> I needed to know. I was genuinely curious. Um, <laughs> uh, I did hit a Mario Kart. That is a good way to put it. Uh, you can also leave us a rating review. Uh, like? Uh, like this one, which was apparently <laughs> left on Podcast Addict uh, some months ago. Uh, okay. And then Broverdown won't stop bothering me on Twitter about it. Classic Broverdown. Another one of my stream uh, fans. I mean, is it Mollusk? What would you call him? Uh, annoyance. Uh, yeah. My name is William Hughes, and this is a legally binding statement. I am saying this voluntarily, and everything is factually correct. On the date of the 15th of May, 2021, I, William Hughes, did in fact go boom boom in my pants. That is all. Oh, fuck. Dude. And that's a five-star review. I can't believe you went boom boom and then we didn't talk about it on the show. I know. It's really tragic. Uh, yeah. You know, I have sharded myself not that long ago. How long ago? Eh, about Less 12 than a minutes. Month? Less than a month? Uh, for me, it's been longer than that, but I can't judge you for a general shard. Yeah, we, we're both men of gut troubles. <laughs> yeah, Dan Hood. Um, uh, it's like a "How I Met Your Mother" joke, man. Is it? Yeah, General Shart. Not General Shart, but like General Nuisance or whatever. And they also. Oh. Well, it's also a joke on the level. Shout hey. out to David. Hey, Dennis. Um, 
Good night. Podcast end. Podcast end. Uh, I, People leaving these reviews instead of the fucking review about playing the show for their D and D group, which was like wholesome and good. The the, uh, the disgust in your voice of that's a how you how I met your mother joke is very yeah. good. <laughs> you know I've never seen that before. You know I didn't pull that. I know. It, so that's why it makes it a pure insult because you're like that's hacky and you didn't even copy it from something. Yeah. You you came up with the same shit that the how I met your mother idiots came up with. You think like them? I do. Are you ready? Yes, sir. <laughs>